The world of biotechnology never stops to amaze me. And in today's video, I'm here to talk about a recent development which might come your way as a big bunch of opportunities. Well, I'm talking about a recent news where Johns Hopkins University is in talks with the Ministry of Education and recently the Union Education Minister Dharmendra Pradhan had a high level delegation from the university and they had a discussion on this initiative to set up an offshore campus in India. So today in this video, we're going to analyze four or five points how this is a great news for all the biotech students, researchers and scientists who might get a lot of opportunities in the future. So to start with, let me talk about the potential benefits which this news brings to all of you. Now, first thing first, it leads to enhanced educational opportunities for all the students learning there because this proposed campus will offer advanced programs in biotechnology and related fields. It will provide you access to the world-class education research facility without even leaving India. So that's a great news. But it's a bad news for all those universities who are already in India because if Johns Hopkins is coming, then definitely it will give a run for money for other great universities in India, right? So that's a bad news for others. But yeah, good news for our subscribers and students. Now, the second great news for all of you is if Johns Hopkins is coming to India, then collaborative research opportunities will take a boom and they will not just come, they'll come with a lot of funding as well, right? So Johns Hopkins has a history of impactful collaborations uh, already in India and such as uh, the Gupta Klinsky India Institute is there, which mobilizes the faculty, staff and students and alumni to work with Indian partners on research, education, policy and practice and this new campus could further facilitate joint research, internships and training programs enhancing practical experience and exposure for students and professionals and it might uh, lead to more joint opportunities, joint research opportunities with CSIR labs which can lead to a more employment opportunities and more startups might come out of this university's campus in India. The third benefit obviously will be employment prospects. So anybody who is in their bachelor's or master's right now wants to build a career in teaching, if they qualify CSI and do their PhD and have two, three years of experience by the time this university, university is set up, then of course you can get a job as a scientist or a researcher or a professor in Johns Hopkins University in their offshore campus in India. So that's the third benefit you can get. Now, the fourth one obviously will be networking and professional growth. So basically, you join this university as whatever whatever role. It will help you get exposed to international researchers and you might get a chance to work in international projects and eventually get into international campuses or international labs elsewhere in Germany, France, US, UK, wherever you want to, right? I think it's a great news for all the Biotechnica subscribers and students. So this is one such news. There are many more news happening and going to happen in the near future, which we are keeping tap off and will keep you updated on our channel. So don't forget to subscribe and like this video and share with all your friends and colleagues who might be benefited with this analysis. Now, last thing which I wanted to highlight here is Johns Hopkins is the tip of the iceberg. There are 25 more universities and labs and companies who are planning to have offshore campuses in India and that includes Illumina as well. So we are looking at an explosion of opportunities for biotech graduates, postgraduates and PhDs in the next five years in India. So do not stop pursuing what you're doing. Put in a lot of effort and attention to what you're doing. Grow in your career because if you succeed, that's what will be our achievement. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you soon on the next one. Till then, keep shining. Take care. Bye-bye.